Once a week, um, we had a, a common room and um, we were allowed to bring a friend in because it was a big naval base and the, the wrens were working there. And um, we used to have an at home. We had tea and biscuits and they used to come and they played the piano. Um, there was always a piano there. And um, uh, funnily enough, when the Americans came, one or two of them were invited because you could only come. You know, we didn't have masses of them, just a few. And um, we had a darts board, and I remember that these Americans um, had never played darts. They'd never seen a dart board, and they were really intrigued about this. And, um, yes, we had a very good social life. We used to go to the, um, the local um, church, um, uh, what do you call it, um, uh, hall. We were always welcome there, uh, but they used to do uh, the the uh, dancing, the Scottish dancing, the locals, um, to the bagpipes, and that was quite interesting. And I met a girl there, she was an ATS girl in uniform, which was very odd because they were all naval bods, and I said to her, well, you know, what are you doing here? And she said, I'm on leave, so I should do. I said, well, where are you stationed? Oh, she said, it's miles and miles from here. You'd never, ever heard of it. It's a place called Cheltenham. Well, of course, I came from Cheltenham, so I was amazed. And I gave her my parents' phone number, and she visited them. And then she took me to her house, and um, into, uh, I met her mother. But her mother only spoke the Gaelic, because all the villagers spoke Gaelic. And uh, her sisters could speak English. They're very, very religious, and um, before they even had a cup of tea, they would say grace, but of course in Gaelic, and they were very welcoming, and I often used to visit them when I was off duty. We didn't have many, much time off, we sometimes, we always had Sunday off, but often we had to work on Saturdays, um, not the girls at the base, but um, I did, well, some of them may have done, and um, we used to get, when we were off duty, it was wonderful country. We used to go over to the Isle of Skye and take a bike and cycle over there. But of course, there was no vegetation there um, because it was rather rough ground and all the milk had to come by train from Inverness and, um, and the vegetables. There were no things like lettuce or anything like that there. But we had wonderful cooks. And it was a lovely, the girls were lovely. They're just like sisters to me. Um, I just wish I'd kept up with them all. There's only one that I'm in communication with now.